Hello Disneyland fans, back once again to be showing you guys a whole bunch of Star Wars Galaxy Edge merchandise. So don't forget to subscribe if you like seeing all sorts of new stuff for Disneyland and old. Uh, this is the channel for you. So right now we are looking at, you can see the Millennium Falcon. Um, some of these are the very first pieces that the Star Wars land has brought on us out as far as pins. And this is a really nice fancy pin. These are going to be very collectible. We're going to be taking a look at quite a few different pins. And some of the awesome other merchandise for Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Let's take a look at another one. We are looking at another Star Wars Galaxy Edge you know, just so detailed, you know, the Millennium Falcon, the Disney pins are anywhere from $5.99 to $6.99 to $10 to $13. Prices go all over the place, but depending on where you end up, if you have to buy it somewhere else, the prices do go up quite a bit. But I'd ought to say these are going to be very collectible and very rare. So, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of some of this awesome Star Wars merch. Let's look at our next item. Alright, this pin is just awesome. R2-D2. You did see the Money of Falcon taking off. This is one of the ones that is just so cool. The detail from R2-D2, the top of it, the Money of Falcon. I think they did a great job on this piece right here. So, Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Just so incredible. Just so detailed. Um, let me know what you guys think. Let's take a look at another awesome eye of them. So these are really cool, around like a hundred bucks, you guys can pick one of these up at the park. I think they're really cool, you know, really tiny, you know, from the Star Wars. I think, you know, they don't do, do a bad job. I mean, they also have it where you can build your own droid for about a hundred bucks, which is very cool. But so far, you know, this is a really cool. Let's take another look at some more merch. So this one's not a little bit more of a color thing to it, which is pretty cool. You can see the blue and the yellow really looking well to that -er. So not bad, you know, like I said, some of this stuff isn't the cheapest, but you'll never forget building or creating any of this stuff at Disneyland or picking it up. It will make for a great memory. And if you're a huge fan of Star Wars, we'll stay ready to take a look at some more awesome stuff from Star Wars Galaxy Edge. They even got t-shirts for Star Wars Galaxy Edge with the Money of Falcon 2019, uh, 531 when it opened. So really, you know, exciting, really cool looking t-shirt. Um, you know, sizes will vary. Um, you guys are going to want to, you know, try and get what you can before it's up and stuff. But this is definitely a cool item from Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Let's take a look at some more stuff for you guys. Star Wars Galaxy Edge t-shirt, really cool. You know, another t-shirt to show you guys. One of the ones that you can pick up if you make it to the park. Give you guys a little bit closer, you can see the Millennium Falcon and just the detail at one end of this is pretty cool. Um, but let's take a look at some more Star Wars merchandise. For you sitting at home, they also have a bag you can pick up, which is really cool for Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Millennium Falcon R2-D2, you know, the detail you can see, not bad. You know, definitely going to be a nice collector's item. So let's take another look. Star Wars Galaxy Edge, and you can see right there the giant Millennium Falcon. I think they did a really nice job on this bag. So, another awesome collector's item. If you're a huge fan of Disneyland or just a huge fan of Star Wars, this is something you probably don't want to pick up while you're at the park. Another really cool item is the Star Wars Galaxy Edge patch, which you can sew on to any type of clothing you can think of, from shorts, pants, jacket. So, really cool patch from Star Wars. And, you know, this being a really nice Disneyland item as well. So, let me know what you guys think of the patch down below in the comments. Let's take a look at some more Disney merch. So, one of the other cool options is they, they also have, like, animals and stuff. Certain stuff you guys can build, which is pretty cool. They can come in a little cage. You can get, which is really kind of handy. And these, the prices on these do vary. But I definitely gotta say, I think they were really cool design. And they brought out for Star Wars. So there's quite a bit of different stuffed animals. So I'll be showing you guys some more of these. 
So another really cool thing, you know, if the cage and stuff, I think definitely really cool. Um, take another look to show you. So you put it in the cage. Uh, really weird looking, but you know, it is a Star Wars character, as you did see. I think the detail and some of these are really cool. Some of them have sound and all sorts of stuff. But I'd honestly say they went to a lot of work to put these awesome things together. So here's another very weird Star Wars thing. You can see the detail on it. Really, really different. The boxes is something, you know, you can see you're probably going to keep it inside the box, not going to take it out. But, you know, you can see the detail, kind of gross looking. But Star Wars fans and Disneyland fans, let me know what you guys think of this. Definitely, you know, done a lot of detail on some of this Star Wars stuff. But I definitely got to say they brought out a really cool stuff this year for Star Wars Land. But not bad. So before we end the video, I got to say this is probably the coolest one so far that I think. Um, either way, let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. I'll be back to show you guys more Star Wars stuff. Don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for a lot more stuff coming. Thank you for watching.